Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to declare the result for the Rochester and Strood constituency. I, Neil Davis, being the acting returning officer for the constituency, hereby give notice that the number of votes given for each candidate is as follows. Prue Bray, Liberal Democrat, 1251. Daniel John Terence Byrne, Trade Unionist and Socialist Coalition, 202. Clive Bryn Malcolm Gregory, Green Party, 1516. Nushaba Parveen Khan, Labour Party, 10,396. Mark John Reckless, UK Independence Party, UKIP, 16,009. And Kelly Jane Talhurst, the Conservative Party candidate, 23,142. That, that was 23,142. And declare that Kelly Jane Talhurst has been elected as the Member of Parliament for the constituency of Rochester and Strood. I would like to thank the people of Rochester and Strood who today have come out in force to have their say on the future of their area and their country. I'd like to thank the police, the returning officer, Medway Council and all the staff in Rochester and Strood and across Medway that have been involved with making sure these elections have passed smoothly. I would also like to thank my fellow candidates, particularly Nashaba Khan, Prue Bray and Clive Gregory, who have run lovely campaigns, and it's been a pleasure to be alongside with them. I feel extremely honoured to be standing here and want to thank everybody who voted Conservative today. I would also like to give a big thanks to my agent, Andrew McNess, my local association, and all the volunteers that have helped me and my campaign over these last seven months. The right result has been delivered this morning. Yeah. I was born and bred in this constituency and care passionately about the place that I have lived all my life and about the people that I have grown up with. By electing me as your MP, you have elected someone who will fight for this area and the people to deliver what is needed. I will work tirelessly in Rochester West, uh, sorry, Rochester and Street, <laughs> force of habit, to make Medway an even better place than it is at the moment. We ran a strong and positive campaign in Rochester and Strood, focused on the economy because the economy comes first, making the country be able to move forward with stability. We've made positive commitments to the British people in this election, providing 30 hours a week free childcare for working parents, three to four year olds, introducing a tax free minimum wage cutting taxes for 30 million people by raising the personal allowance, creating 2 million more jobs, continuing with the Conservative Party's record that we have delivered in the last Parliament. We have a strong leader in David Cameron and we have fought on local issues here. I have fought around Medway Hospital, development in the right place, safer streets, more jobs and more infrastructure, for Rochester and Strood and better education. I promise I will represent you and the people of all of Rochester and Strood with integrity to make the lives of the people that are living here better. Thank you.